Bulls. What a name. Reminds me of uh, Portal. And like a mix of like Portal and like the back rooms. All the water is black. Physics, of course, yeah, you gotta have them. More blackness. That's not good. Oh, that's definitely not good. Yep. Why would you go in there? Oh, that instantly kills you? You can't rewind time. Feels like an AI build this game, I'm not gonna lie. The way everything's like set up. Oh shit, that's, that's bad. The graphics are really good. Again, probably using that, you know, real life mod, whatever the hell it's called. Oh, you can also use slides? Okay. Oh, that's nice. Where are you? <laughs> I'm guessing this is like the whole game, just like exploring. Instead of exploring the back rooms, you're exploring the, uh, the pools. Is that somebody? Is that a person that's a ball? What is that? There's like a shadow there. Getting like a jump scare or something? Yeah, everything's like very surreal, right? Mm -hmm. Can you see the footsteps? Okay, so just uh, an eerie, creepy experience for you. But at the same time, it seems like very relaxing. It seems like very peaceful of a game. And I love how, like, you know, like they make the world like all black also, so you can see what's inside and, you know, something that grabs you or something, you know? But again, at the same time, again, it feels like an AI build this game. The way some of the levels are set up and it's like, you know, random objects being thrown all over the place. At the same time, that's kind of like the whole point of the game, right? Like in this very strange other dimension or some crap where again i'm pretty sure they're using that um i don't know what it's called real life real life mod or something you know kind of like all these games that you see lately come out where like everything the shadows look really good and the lack of shadows look really good at the same time um what a what an experience thank you for watching peace out